Hey y'all, don't forget to hit those buttons over there where you're listening. We've got bomb threats rattling Springfield for the second day as Ohio City finds itself at the center of the latest controversy. We all know what he said. He is also threatening to imprison people if he is if he wins. I'm not sure why experts are worried, but they are. A Virginia sixth grader was suspended for waiting too long to report that a classmate had a B-U-L-L-E-T in his pocket. Apparently, it was right before they were taking their standardized test. He saw it. He didn't report it to the principal for two hours later, and when he did, he got suspended. I guess the Emmys are happening. We already know Kendrick Lamar is heading the Super Bowl halftime show. Yay, Beyonce's Cowboy Carter was not name it, not nominated for a country music award. I'm not real sure why. It says the album had stirred up debate about the historical role of African Americans in the genre. I would think that that album should, should certainly be in the running. Um, readers shared their songs of the summer, including some of Chappelle Roan and the Cranberries. A sing, uh, singer from the band Danity Kane sued Sean Combs, accusing him of threatening and groping her. That was it's a whole lot more. You can certainly, surely, you've already read it. Also, on the note of Diddy. He was also sued by a Michigan inmate, and uh, that inmate was awarded $100 million by the judge. Um, Dave Grohl, we've heard about that. He's got him a young young lady with a, a new baby. And JT pleaded guilty. This stuff about Pope Francis said that Trump, who opposes migrants, and Kamala Harris, who supports abortion rights, are both against life. And I don't understand why are we still listening to the Catholic Church and the Pope do y'all remember they were like they, they have an island where they send like offenders you know they're like 30 of them there I, I don't understand why we still even care or this is even why don't we just stop at that boar's head i guess is finally going to shut down the plant i'm surprised it wasn't already shut down uh jessica ramos a, C, a state senator from queens became the latest candidate to say that she would run against mayor eric adams whose administration faces multiple investigations. We know that they are in trouble. He's got AIDS getting... Oh, going through all of it. And still so out of touch with the common person. Who house hunts for $650,000? What you get for $1.4 million? And then this sent me back to Lifestyles of the Rich and Famous. And what was that guy's name? Something Robin Lynch or something. And how... I don't know. Ugh. It's just disgusting. Don't forget to hit those buttons over there. I hope your day doesn't suck. Hey, love y'all. Bye.